Good morning, everybody. I hate to start a Sunday like this with really sad news. I put a video up on Friday about Madeline. Gorgeous, gorgeous woman. Life in front of her. Everything on the right track. I did a video on Friday and we spoke about her on the live saying that she is missing. Well, yesterday, she, her remains were found. And, um... The suspect is in custody. The suspect is an ex-boyfriend, from my understanding, Mario Chacon. It's just gruesome. It's disgusting what he did. She joins a long list of women who had everything going for them, and it was taken by the man that they were supposed to trust. It's horrible. And... I don't know when this is going to end, but I'm going to share this with you. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. It's nine at 10. I'm Christina Burgess. The 10 day search for a 20 year old missing woman, Madeline Patoha, has come to an end. According to Midland Police this afternoon, Mario Juan Chacon Jr. has been taken into custody in connection to her death. Hunter Acosier is at the Midland Police Department where he has more details. Hunter. Yeah, Christina, earlier today, Midland police found remains identified as Madeline Pantoja in the area approximately three miles east of County Road 190 and County Road 1160. According to the Midland County Sheriff's Office de detainee roster, uh, Chacon was charged with first degree murder in connection to her death. As seen in this as seen in this video from someone at the scene at the time, at 3.30 in the afternoon, Midland police detectives arrested 24-year-old Mario, Mario Juan Chacon. MPD started an, an extensive investigation and search for Madeline on May 11th after she was reported missing. An autopsy will be performed in Dallas County and the investigation is still ongoing. Nexican has been notified. We'll keep you up updated here on News West 9 the, as this story progresses. Christina. Thanks, Hunter.